Hello ladies and gentlemen, Karin Petty here again with Automated Wealth Network and in this video I want to teach you how to build a fan page and we're going to do it 2015 style. <laughs> I've actually been getting a lot of messages lately um, from people who are new and starting online, you know, exactly how to create one. And I do have training on my YouTube channel right now, but honestly, it's from about two years ago. So I want to get everything up to date to 2015 to be able to help you more efficiently. And the simple fact that Facebook changes things so much all the time, quicker than you can go through a box of tissue when you have the flu. So it's best to stay on top of it all. So first of all, you may be asking, you have probably heard, you know, people keep saying create a fan page create a fan page right but why do you want to create a fan page because you have to remember that Facebook actually has billions of users on it and millions of them are on there at any given time this is the perfect way to expand your presence online to actually get people more people to see your business and your opportunity or whatever it is that you would like to expand your audience to and as you take time to build your fan page you are going to definitely create a big fan base where you can actually interact you know one on one with the people who are interested in what you're doing or what you're showing them or what you're training you know if you decide you want to do training later on like I do um, it's just it's a really 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 great way um, and a great tool for you to use in your business and the beautiful thing is that Facebook allows you to create as many fan pages as you would like but you don't want to go creating a fan page for the exact same thing over and over again this will get spammy and this can get your account deleted you do not want to do that okay so let's get right to the basics so the first thing you're gonna to want to do in order to find where to set up a fan page is you want to make sure you click on the home button when you are logged into Facebook this is going to bring you to your news feed now you want to make sure that you are not actually located on your main profile which would be right here okay because you're not going to find it here you have to be in your news feed so select home now everything is blurred out here and over to the right the reason being is I like to keep everybody's you know information private <laughs> So you, what you need to be paying attention to anyways is this side here and over on the left if you scroll down and you can see I play a lot of games I love little Facebook games but we're not talking about that right now but if you scroll down on the left you're gonna find a section called pages now somewhere in there it is actually going to say create page so that's what you want to click on first now once you have clicked on create page it's time for you to select and tell Facebook what kind of page it is that you are creating so let's say you have a home business usually it for home business I select company organization or institution but if it's you know a brand or a product of something else that you're doing just go through all of the different options here once you click on one of them all you need to do is just use the drop down menu and look through here and see if there's anything listed that you know is kinda close to what it is that your Facebook page is going to be about so in this example I'm just gonna scroll down here and collect small business okay now collect I don't even know why I said that anyways select <laughs> and then right here is where you want to give your company name now I already have a fan page that's attached to my company name so I'm just gonna do an example and just go Karen's uh, video page okay then next click get started and then give it just a few moments and you're gonna be taken to this page right here now for time's sake I could skip through all of this but I'll run through it with you really quick right here is where you're gonna to want to tell Facebook and tell people what your page is about and what your business is about so enter your biz description book description here however you want to enter it now this is very important right here where it says website this is where you're actually going to place the external link to your business or opportunity so that when people click on it that's where they're taken so my main website is www.karin petty.com so that's what I'm gonna put in there and then I'm gonna click on save info I almost hit skip next is your profile picture now it's very very important that I point something out to you people join people not opportunities just being straight up when people use like just a picture of a pretty beach or something where another person can't see them um, this actually this actually attracts a little bit of a disconnect between you and somebody who may be interested in your business so my recommendation is don't be shy put a real picture of yourself up there now if you're not comfortable with that you don't have to I'm just giving you a little uh, you know a little tip in biz but anyways what you want to do is select a profile picture you can upload it or import it from a website but 
but for time's sake I'm just going to skip and go to the next one. Right here where it says add to favorites, all this will do is if you click add to favorites on your home feed, like I showed you when we first started, there's a favorite section and it'll actually just place the link to you, uh, your page in the favorites there so that you can easily navigate and find it. Once you do that, you want to click next and this is your this is where you're gonna tell people or tell Facebook you know the target locations um, if you just want to you know people in the United States to see it you would put USA or if you want it worldwide you, you can just leave it blank or whatever um, here you want to choose the audience age um, absolutely I mean that's exactly what, what it explains right there from age of the targeting audience you're looking for and really you don't have to do any of this this is just an added extra step that they give you so you can help to target traffic to your fan page for your opportunity or your business. So again, I'm just going to I'm just going to click save just to get out of this. And now bam, done. That is how fast you can create a fan page. Now, once you do, this is sorry my little my notifications are going off. Once you do, take the time because Facebook is explaining to you what everything is. So just click next to see and understand. I'm going to like my own page and then, you know, it's just going to give you a little tour so you understand what everything is on your fan page. The next thing you want to do is upload a picture for your cover photo. So you can do that by selecting add cover and then upload photo and I'm just gonna put in this pretty little photo um, but if oh well, I can't because it doesn't fit <laughs> but if you actually have a banner for your business or you want to create one or whatever opportunity you're in they provide one for you that's where a good place to upload it and just make it a cover photo about your business and then there's your wall post. I would actually say hello, welcome people to your fan page and get your fan page started because what's going to happen is as you start building your business and as you start growing, you want to link people back to your fan page so they can have a chance to interact with you, to ask you questions, all of that. And this is what's going to grow your audience. So let's say you start a blog out there. You can always place a link on your blog to your fan page and say hey connect with me here on Facebook just like you see in my videos my links in my videos will bring you to my fan page so you can connect with me personally and then if you need more training just return to YouTube and, and continue on with more training if you need it but this is exactly how to build a fan page and then you're gonna start putting quality content so talk about your business you know show people about your business and while people are starting to come to your page they'll start to interact with you and this is really huge exposure exposure for your yourself and for your business. So that is exactly how you set up a fan page. Have fun with making pictures for your cover art and stuff like that. If you want to share useful information from somebody else who's got a great video out and you think it's going to benefit your audience, by all means grab the link, post it there. So now you know how to make a fan page and remember you can make as many as you want. So I really hope this helped. I love you all and I'll see you on the next video. Ciao for now everyone.